My name is Tony Brown. I'm an interventional radiologist with RIA Endovascular. Today I am interested in talking to you about uh, knee pain. Uh, knee pain is something that, uh, that affects a whole bunch of us, especially we who live here in, uh, in Denver, Colorado because we're so active. Um, as we age, uh, our knees take a beating. And I think a lot of people are familiar with the common remedies for knee pain. Um, it's the rest, ice, and elevation if it's an acute injury. Uh, and if you get into a more chronic type of knee pain, a lot of times you're going to go see an orthopedic uh, doctor and it may, maybe the recommendation will come for a knee replacement. Um, this is something that, that a lot of people will experience in their lifetime is that their joint degenerates. It, it used to work well, but the cartilage uh, essentially the shock absorbing mechanism in between the bones of the knee wears down. And as that wears down, you start to have the bones rubbing on each other. That arthritis within the knee is very painful. Um, and the, the remedy uh, for somebody who has this type of arthritis uh, is to replace the joint. Essentially, they just remove the joint and put a metallic one in there. And metal doesn't hurt when you put weight on it. So it works pretty well. Um, there's a specific uh, type of patient where I think uh, interventional radiology uh, and we here at RI Endovascular can really come in to play and be helpful in, in, in this population. And that's a person who's maybe a little too young to get a knee replacement. Um, knee replacements, um, obviously metal is a little bit different than the natural cartilage and it can wear out over time. So if you're too young, uh, either your orthopedic surgeon has decided that a knee replacement is maybe not a great idea for you because you're too young or you yourself are not ready to go down that road, there's some options that we may have for you uh, in order to alleviate your knee pain. And um, those two options include uh, what's called a genicular nerve block or ablation. And that's where we anesthetize the nerves that see the pain from the joint. Um, it doesn't do anything to treat your arthritis. The definitive therapy for the arthritis is the, is, is the uh, joint replacement. But if you're in that place where you're going to try to wait, uh, but you still want your knee pain treated, um, just masking the pain by blocking the nerves or destroying those nerves, they're just sensory nerves, they don't affect your, your movement, that can be really helpful to you in, in the short term. Um, and so that's called genicular nerve ablation. Uh, and that's a, that's a service that we provide here at RI Endovascular, and it's been very useful uh, for these patients trying to stave off a knee replacement for a period of time. Where it can also be useful is in those patients who get a knee replacement and unfortunately still suffer from knee pain. Um, if you get a knee replacement, the cartilage has been replaced, but there's some other issue there. There's some other pain coming from uh, or around the joint uh, that, that, that this procedure may be useful for. So that can be useful if that's you. If you're somebody who's had a knee replacement and you still have knee pain, this procedure where we mask the pain coming from the knee joint uh, can be useful. And the third uh, possibility here is a very new procedure that we're really excited about called genicular artery embolization. That's a mouthful, but what it is is if you have knee pain from a degenerative joint, but it's not from the joint itself, it's from the soft tissues around the joint, we can actually, by kind of adjusting or blocking some of the blood flow to that inflamed tissue, uh, treat your pain. So genicular artery embolization is a, is a possibility. And when you come in for evaluation for your knee pain, uh, we look at the possibilities. Is this the soft tissue? Is this the joint? Have you had a joint replacement? And we kind of determine what's gonna be the right therapy for you. But the bottom line is, is that there's multiple therapies for people outside of getting their joint replaced, uh, or even if they've had their joint replaced, uh, where we could be beneficial uh, to you and get you kind of moving around again like we, like we Coloradans like to do. So uh, there's some good options for those painful knees here at RA Endovascular, um, and we're, we're, ready to, we're ready to offer those to those people who need it.